Hello everybody, my name's Snugglebot, and today we're going to play a game called Dream Defense. It looks a lot like a tower defense mode, but from the few brief moment, because it just kicks you right in, it doesn't have you log in or anything, it loads and then sets you straight to it. Here, down here on the side, yeah, over on the side, that's what it does as soon as you load in. I kid you not, it does not give you time to think at all. It just takes it and it runs. It's got a nice little story, it looks like the kid is sleeping, and here comes the nightmares, and Teddy's here to defend it. So we'll go ahead and get right into it and see what we can do here. Man, protect Robin, tap on the monsters, shoot them. Alright, so it's a clicky game. And I have to reload. Tap and hold to shoot continuously. Okay, okay. Got a little semi automatic action going on. I think I am shooting them with feel good pelts. I thoroughly enjoy the fact that he is dressed ready to roll like any other good action movie that you're prepared for. He's got his red bandana and his bandolier of ammo. Unlock the firecracker. Damages multiple enemies. First clear bonus, some diamonds. Perfect. Dragon drop power-ups to use them against monsters. Noted. Great job, Roberto. Oh, the bear has a name. It's Roberto. Oh, Roberto. Ro bear get it Roberto it's good tap to enter the next level so one two house of horrors firecrackers deal large damage to an area use firecrackers in a group of ghosts drag and drop on the enemies to clear them out ah there we go that'll that'll learn them So I think those purple guys, yeah, they got a little bit more health, so we're gonna have to gonna have to tap them a few more times here. We're gonna not use the firecrackers, because I don't know if they come back after each match. I don't know if I'm gonna start with five each time or if I have to conserve them. But look at that, didn't need it for night two. Another night good sleep. We're gonna get this kid. We're gonna get him all the way to adulthood without any issues. None whatsoever. He's going to have no complexes growing up. Well, that we can stop from. So we're shooting them with a paintball gun. Perfect. Perfect. Splash damage. Good against clumped enemies. Oh no, this is the paintball gun. We unlocked it. We unlocked the paintball gun. Do we get to switch it? More nightmares are coming. Let's keep going. Ah, so it tells me the enemy types that's going to be going. Equipped weapons. So I get 60 shots with the, with the paintball gun. Um, it looks like there's like a bird thing. Okay, so yeah, no, I don't, I don't get back to five fireworks. I have four. I started with five. I'm at four again. We'll drop one in this mission to see if they gave me that extra one for the tutorial, but I have a feeling they didn't. I have a feeling that they're going to be like, nope, nope, you only get so many firecrackers. Pesky buggers. The paintball gun uses ammo and can hit several enemies at once. Switch to the paintball gun now. Tap to switch the gun. Oh, there we go. Multi-kill. So we don't need that now. Now we're going to need it because there's a couple of them coming. We're here to help. Tap on the cheat for bonus rewards. Oh, nice. Firecracker. So that's how we're going to get our firecrackers back is by tapping on the sheet for the little bonus rewards. Pretty confident in the fact that I don't need to use the gun for everything. More shotgun. It got way too much, so we'll switch back to that shotgun. There we go. Made it through another night. No problem. Roberto is a man among bear. We unlocked an armory. Upgrade weapons, power up, and buy ammo at the armory. Oh, neato. We get to buy ammo. Now we don't have to depend on these sheep to do everything for us. So we got the armory down here. Welcome to the armory. You can buy ammo and upgrades here. Buy ammo free. Oh, I mean, if you insist. Is it just going to be free all the time? Power up. Okay, see, now it's going to cost me money to do that. Mm hmm. Mm hmm. Tap to increase the clip size. You have enough Dream Ore for an upgrade. Dream Ore. 
That's what we've been collecting from these suckers. Use dream arms and coins to upgrade the weapon. Confirm upgrade, free, free. I like it. It's my favorite four letter word next to cake. I don't like cake, but I like the word cake. I like the concept of cake. The idea of cake pleases me. So let's go to level four. This survival level is harder than the rest. Be sure to stock up on ammo. Oh, okay, well. Since you insist, let's get some uh let's get some ammo for our shotgun. Where's our money? Oh, top left. We got plenty. Let's upgrade this. Oh, we're missing whatever this thing on the right is. I think that's the dream ore. Yeah, we're we're missing some dream ore. We'll buy some more ammo though. We'll come in ready. With uh with just right over a hundred one hundred and one shots. I think I think that's gonna be enough for us to uh take out whatever they throw at us whatever they th we are prepared so we gotta survive the night for one minute that's a boot that's a boot don't like that drop the drop the firecracker on him clear him out all right I thought we were gonna be able to do it with just the uh with just the regular shot but that's a lot of stuff coming at me Get the boot. Come on, get the boot. Get get these guys over here. Wow, this is a... Uh... What do you got? What do you got for me? Some coin? Fine. Could've used another firecracker, but I'll take the coin. How much time do we have left? Okay, we almost made it. We almost used up our entirety of the clips. We're halfway through it. That's right. Paint in your eyes. Splatter. Splatter. What else you got? We we'll use a regular gun for you. You're not worth the paint. There we go. Another successful night. Sheepy mission. Oh, we unlocked a sheepy mission. Send sheep on mission to gather dream ore. You won. I don't need to watch the ad to get the extra one. What do we got here? 278 coins. 85 what I assume to be dream ore. We got that nice little cloud and moon in there and a little bit more coins And we'll go ahead and go back to the map Sheeps and waiting send sheeps out on missions to get more dream ore for or upgrades Okay, well that just seems foolish not to veteran sheep Returns in 12 hours with huge reward returns in eight hours with large reward returns in four hours with a modest reward so we'll go ahead. It seems they want us to send out the guy that is fully decked out. Look at him. He is ready. He is ready to find some stuff. He's got his little man satchel, backpack. He's got a frying pan for when he's hungry. He's got his little mining helmet. And then, of course, he's got a pickaxe. And to top it all off, goggles. No adventure is complete without a set of goggles. All right. Let's rush the sheep mission to get our reward instantly. Ah, a free rush. This game is all too kind to me. See, this game is this game is teasing us. It's showing us all the stuff we can do. And then it's like, well, you know, you don't have the resources now that it's not free. But look how cool it was before. Oh look, more Dream Ore. More Dream Ore. And even more Dream Ore. Look at all that stuff they just threw us. It's like they want us. It's like they want us to do it. So we're gonna go ahead and send them out for 12 hours, because I don't see why not. We're not gonna rush them, we don't need to. Then we can anyways, we only have 55 rubies. Can we upgrade the paintball gun? We can, let's upgrade this baby. Increase the damage. Good, cause if we're shooting groups of enemies, we wanna do as much damage as quickly as possible as to, you know, thin them out. We'll get our, our gun back up to uh, 100 bullets and then we'll we're gonna spend the rest of our money on this gun to to get some bullets to prepare for. All right, mission five, night five. And this sneaky little peak level lets us try future equipment for free. Let's go. Oh, we get to try future equipment, neato. Equipped weapons, equipped power up. So we got a bow dart gun. It's just a dart bow and some ice cream. Let's see what we can do. Let's see what kind of mayhem we can cause to those nasty bed bugs. 
the boogie, the boogie army. Sneak peek, win the level with the provided items and ammo. Start. Some enemies will have shields around them for additional power. Pop them instantly with the dart bow gun. Nice. It just penetrates. If the enemy gets too close, you can stop them from moving, freezing them with the creamer freezer. Oh, neato. Give them some brain freeze. Let's get a few more people coming out here. There we go. There we go. That's using the noodle. Kill as many as possible with each shot. That's a good grouping. That's right. Waste no arrow. Freeze those guys up. Shoot with that. There we go. Final wave. Be gone. What do you got for me, little sheepy? Some coin? That's fine. I'll take that. I'll take some coin. What do you got? What do you got? Come on. Give me more. Look at you guys. Shooting your, shooting your freaking bug goop at me. Bed bug goop. Oh, Mm. You've unlocked the dart bow. Well, if you say so. Shoot piercing darts. Good against bubbled shields. Good against just enemies, period. You didn't need to add that extra sentence in there. Got 13 shots with arguably my favorite weapon thus far. Like, seriously, it just pierces everything? Come on. How's that even fair? All right, so now we have the group of enemies and shielded enemies which I feel like I'm gonna have to pay close enough attention to switch between the bow gun, the dart bow, and the regular gun. How hard is it to take out the shield? Well, that wasn't too difficult. Take out these boots. Some rank ass feet over there. Got another boot sneaking down on us on the bottom here. Come on, come on. We're going to avoid using our secondary weapons as much as we can. Whoo, made it. Mainly because I feel like when the levels start to hit the fan, that's when we're gonna need to use them. Right now, we're not hurting. We're not hurting too bad. As you can see, we were able to take them out. Now, they didn't come in any sort of like packed wave, so that may, that probably made a huge difference. Now, if they were coming like multiple at a time, we were gonna have to switch it up a little bit and take the hit there. See, that paid off. We came out with 801 uh, more coin to use. So we'll get back in there. Mission seven, we are going to make it a week protecting this kid's dreams, a full week. All right, here we go. Once again, we're gonna try the same strategy of, oh, no, we gotta switch it up. They're coming in too hot. There we go, thinned them out a little bit. So it's a good thing we increased the damage on the shotgun, uh, I'm sorry, paintball gun, because apparently it is just going to chew through their shields like it's nobody's business. Come on, get the shoe, get the shoe, get the shoe. Switch out to the bow. Living life too close to the edge for my liking. That was close. I don't know what would have happened if he made it to the bed, but I assume he was gonna put a hurting on me. Scary ghost, scary ghost. Terrible freaking shoes. Be gone, you alligator shoes. Be gone. You do not match my handbag. You've unlocked quest. Ooh, neato quest. For skins and other rewards. All right, all right. I like skins and I'm not opposed to other rewards either. If you want to give me rewards, I'll take rewards. I have no problem with that. So Roberto the bear and Robin the kid. Right now I'm equipped with the skin and I am just his best friend. Collect shards to unlock the skins and level them up. You can get them from Daily Quest at the store. Oh, it's a chicken soup. Reminds me of Fable. I wonder if it's blue. Oh, so they're not going to give me a free skin. That's where they draw the line. All right. So I think that does it for this uh, this episode here of Dream Defense. A lot of fun. It not quite a tower defense game. I was I thought it was going to be a tower defense game for what I saw in the pictures with it. More like an equipped shoot 'em down game. I mean, you're definitely stationary. It it doesn't look like there's a whole lot of um, challenge to the beginning of it. 
but already in that last one, I was shooting the bow at the boots, and it wasn't killing them, uh, like with the one mission where it was doing, you know, one-shot kills. But it's still a fun game, so if you liked the video, go ahead and snuggle on down on that like button and give it a firm, yet sensual, click. And I look forward to seeing all of you in the next video.